Hey guys, what's up? Kosem here on a special adventure today in St. Vincent. Going out to do some fishing with Little Tipsy Charters. I'm at the Blue Lagoon Marina. Very beautiful place. That's why I'm meeting him to go out. Just have to find him. Hopefully we get to do some jigging and catch some fish today. Alright guys, hopefully we catch some fish today. Be a pretty cool adventure nonetheless. The goal is to catch one fish to cook later. Blackfin tuna will be nice. Mahi mahi. Very nice AJ. Taking any of them. guys I just want to pop in the video here to tell you how this whole St. Vincent um, trip fishing trip uh, transpired uh, Captain Mark of Little Tipsy Charters actually messaged me on Instagram to say next time you come to St. Vincent let me take you out fishing I mean that's one super great thing with this YouTube channel they get to interact and meet with people all over the world the Caribbean so that contact is where it all started now I traveled to St. Vincent a, a couple times for the year for work purposes and this time I just so happened to work in a couple hours to go out with Captain Mark. And let me tell you, it was absolutely fantastic. You know, I wasn't sure what kind of fishing he did initially, but when I checked through his photos on Instagram, you see some really quality fish that he caught. Now, you have a couple options to do with him. You could be trolling or you could go jigging. For me, I definitely want to go jigging. If you watch in my previous videos, you see I'm not much into the whole trolling scene. It's not something I enjoy totally. But that the fish we caught while we were trolling out to the spot it was a pretty nice fish so you could check it out so if you like trolling and that's something you want to do and get some maybe target some bigger fish you can do that with them whole day but like i said like if you've never been deep jigging before deep drop jigging definitely give it a try it's one of the most exciting and most fun ways of fishing and that's what i really want to do now now is the best not the best time i mean it's really rough water outside there um captain mark said july august is the best time to go so we didn't have access to all the spots that we wanted to go so we did what we could and we still got a couple of really nice fish. I got a couple other hookers you might not see on camera. One bit off my hook and one bit off the jig completely. But it was a really nice time out there. So if you guys are interested in doing this type of fishing, I'll leave the links to his Instagram page below. Also his contact numbers below in the description. And I highly recommend if you're going to St. Vincent, go on a trip with Captain Mark. You will not regret it. Or even if you're planning a trip to some Caribbean island, maybe St. Vincent and Grenades can be your destination and planning a trip with Captain Mark. Do some deep dropping if you never did it before. It's a lot of fun. So now back to the video. Thanks for watching as always guys. Fish on. Yeah. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Get this 
I'll, I'll record you okay. catching this one. Alright, take it live. That's a nice fish. I watched it. Captain Mark is on. Not too sure what it is as yet. Took a lot of line. He told him to go right along the weed line, eh? and right there he was. <laughs> Chatters. Nice wahoo! Check him out! Oh yeah, fish took us maybe 25 minutes to drive it. That's a nice one. Well done, Captain Mark. Great gap, alright? <laughs> Watch it on the way down because sometimes something the pick fish it up. Hits, yeah. and all of a sudden it stops. Something. And you kind of know, like, wait, that can't be bottom yet. And while you're doing that, because you're trying to get it here, but it always is up there. Yeah, the correct. Right now is, you know, we're three, two to three knots, so it's really quick. But a lot of times you throw and go down, and all of a sudden you see a dolphin jump over there, and you're like, What's oh, look, a dolphin. It's on your line. But it's on your line. <laughs> so you catch almost anything, chicken? Everything. On the bottom. So what we do, so it's on the, I'm on the bottom, right? Right. So because I'm on the bottom, I'm just going to go real slow. Yeah. And then this is where you got to get the, the, the snapper and the super bite. Right. 
and then once I come off the bottom of it, right, let's pick up your piece. Then you just pick up the piece, and then midwater, hammer jacks, jacks, and then towards the surface is you usually get the tuna. Right, the tuna you can pick up shallow. Yeah. Or you can pick it up anywhere. So you can either do it there or yeah. the hip. But the thing is, you get the tip moving. Tip, right. Because with the, the action. Water, or you, if you go like this, it's just doing this, right? Correct. So if you kind of do like this, the jigs. Then the jig is diving all over the place. And a four quarter liter. Right. There you go. So I can do here. I'll go do it again. Who's strong? Let's see how it goes. First drop jig in in St. Vincent. A little tipsy charters. I'm just thinking myself, I'm just thinking myself, I'm gonna go to the other gym. <laughs> Right there. Was a bar? Bar broke off right there. Shit, dog. man. I saw him. Look. Oh, right through the hook. Hook on. Damn. Right to the hook. <laughs> hook out again, Barracuda. Because I didn't lose the jig. At least he didn't lose the jig. Fish on! There we go. Nice fish, fish on, nice. fish on. Nice fish, nice fish. I think I gotta hit this now too, you know. Yeah, my foot's cool. High, low. Go. Bring him, guy. I told you I'd take the fish. <laughs> I don't know why I let the guy drive. <laughs> nice guy, nice guy. Bring him guy, bring him guy.
Should I get close to the bottom? Yeah, right, right Could be snapper. Snida is here. A little Alma cool. Yeah. Got one on each again. Nice, nice. Yeah, if they are around, they'll be in numbers. I think I got a hit almost like two minutes before that. Like 10 seconds before. On the board. Well done, guy. On the board. On the board, man. Beautiful. First fish on the chicken here, guys. Feels pretty decent. Take it on the fall, you know. Is it going down? Or? Yes, it was falling. And he took it. Right up here. Right. Tuna. Tuna circle yeah. and the boat. Oh shit! Oh shit! Damn it! I didn't muscle him at all. Ugh. I didn't muscle him at all. Damn it! We'll yeah. get the next one. Take the, the whole thing on. What man, that felt like a big fish. Nice fish. Yeah boy. Most likely that's such a big fish for a barracuda or something like that. It went through everything like that. Yeah, everything. We'll have a look at the end of it. Tie it on. <laughs> Let me tie this one. Did <laughs> that the other day too, boy. Another one. Let's see if we can get this one in the boat. Feels pretty good. Fairly easy. Captain Mark on as well. Bunks are school here, guys. Let's see what they are. What the hell? Never caught one of those before. <laughs> nice. New species, man. Is that blackjack? Yeah. Nice. First one I ever caught of these. Beautiful. Uh, yes. Beautiful. Now Captain Mark is still on. Let's see what he has. Fish around, fish around. Water, get him in the boat, get him in the boat. Yeah, 
Yeah, that's a nice one. Oh, a nice fish. Nice fish, guy. <laughs> Water resistance. Huh? Probably. Could be an AJ. Eh? Testing out that nut, yeah. testing out everything right now. Black jack. Black. Black jack. Yeah, nice one. Nice one. Big one. Big what? Big one. Shit. Not a big black jack. Three hooks in him, he could never get away. <laughs> Three hooks in him. No way he was coming out. He could have been through two of them. I know where you put it on three hooks for me. You were wondering yeah, why just, nothing, <laughs> why Barra hasn't taken it as yet. Day. Well, Barra on the, <laughs> the value. <laughs> How long he's been there? Yeah, we don't know. We don't know. He might have just got it just now. Huh? Right, really then, You're looking fresh. Right, thank you. Like, uh, and you really say uh, nothing? No, but I couldn't take it as yet. How yeah. come? He was hoping good. We might have been here. No, because we would have seen him dragging. Let me take it a little bit. Yeah, still fresh. This flag indicates Wakawa, but a nice one in the first 25 minutes. Or so. 